folks, Queen Row Kill Candy here today, and today I'm going to show you a box opening of a deck I actually picked up at Value Village for $2.99 plus tax. Uh, so this one's Stress Your Vibes Oracle Cards, a powerful toolkit for awakening your sixth sense. Who it's done by, it's 52 cards. This is backwards. So it shows us three cards here, a little blurb about it, and then again the title. And this is how much it would have been new. Now, since it's U.S. and Canada, I'm guessing this would have been originally sold around 2000 and maybe 5-ish. Because I know for a while we were on power with the States. Maybe it was a little later than that. So, here we have the guidebook. If you don't know, with Oracle decks, basically... It's going to be little blurbs about each of the cards. So some people, when it comes to Oracle decks, some people actually don't use these for divination or anything like that, like tarot decks or anything like that. They'll set out a card and it'll be like an inspirational quote, but it's not quite a quote. It's kind of like, as you can see, it says, see the solutions. And you'll just leave it out to kind of remind yourself of whatever. Ooh. This card's damaged. Well, it is used. Clear the past. Clear the past apparently has been well used. Oh, well, I mean, this deck was $2.99. I actually uh, don't care much for the art. I actually picked it up for someone else. So I'm a little sad that this card's damaged, but um, I know that they're into this. So, get grounded. Walk it off. <laughs> Sounds like something you say. Well, it is what you would say to someone who's drunk, even though that doesn't work. Uh, call on your runners? Runners! Here, boy! Here, runners! I need to go for a jog. Come here. Um, call on your angels. Vibe check! Wow, wow, wow. I like the tuning fork. Like, the way it's done, you can totally, like, I don't know, picture the sound that would go with that. Pray. Aura clear, yeah, cleanse. I assume that's a salt bath. Talk shop. Sounds like they're talking heart, not shop. Sleep on it. I know they're in a bed, but it looks like a dance party. Oomt, oomt, oomt. It's very, um, I would call this art, I know it's impressionistic kind of 90s style, but, um, I would definitely call it very, um, sound oriented like everything kind of looks like it's moving has sound effects like uh seek solutions it's almost like this would have like a growing sound effect in it be grateful exercise your vibes get my vibes little bell weights and dumb weights and have it work out in a vibe gym call in your healing guides Ask your spirit helpers. Which one's the helper and which one's the one asking? Ooh. What do you love? I love anime. You're the boss. Oh yeah, I can see the marionette strings. I guess it's supposed to be like free yourself from that. Call on your joy guides. My video games? <laughs> Claim your boundaries. Be generous. Accept the gifts of the universe. They smell funny. Uh, take your time. Decide. Listen to your heart. And then the song plays in the background. Fake it till you make it. Yeah, that's the number one thing. When you get a job or anything like that, that's what they always say. Fake it till you make it. Because you need the experience and you have to show that you're confident in whatever knowledge you have. And you just need the experience, right? Woo woo is wonderful. Okay. Feed your spirit. Mentors and role models. Cloak yourself in light. Stay in your own skin. You sure? I don't know. I like trying other ones on. <laughs> Laugh. Instant feedback. Eh, 
Instant feedback's not always great. It's not personal. Name your higher self. Clear the path. I know they're supposed to be clearing, but it kind of looks like they're backhanding it to me, the art. Remember to breathe. That's important. Uh, if you don't breathe properly, you know, then you can stress yourself out, cause asthma attacks, different things like that. So it's super important. And if you breathe right, you can calm yourself down. That's why if you see someone having like a panic attack in there by, to hyperventilate, someone's always around saying, breathe, breathe, because that's really important. There's like breathing exercises, different things like that. Because remember, your brain requires oxygen, right? So that's super, super important. Like I said, a lot of these cards are like reminder cards. Play. Expect the best. It's a team effort. Meditate. Downtime. Oh, it's a cute little rat. Um, I should mention there is absolutely no rats in my region. We literally have a rat patrol. Literally. And it's called that. Back to the basics. Learn. Why are their spears getting chucked at them for learning? I, I don't think that's how knowledge looks. Body talk. Share a breath. It reminds me of the Doctor Who episode where he's like, I come bearing... Uh, wind of my lungs or something like that on that it's like a piece of skin that's like the last human or something like that time for crayons <laughs> that would be my mom sound check be flexible let go create a new story Make a note of it. And then, of course, here's the back, all love and winged stuff. And, um, yeah. Like I said, it's very 90s-esque artwork to me. Like, I know there's still people, like, Impressionistic was a lot older, but it's like the modern-er Impressionistic style that probably has its own name, but... Um, because art history really doesn't care much about the contemporary stuff. I don't know its name. The style of the art. Because they kind of have that, um... So that kind of snooty thing of, like, the modern is less important. And so you learn about a lot of the older styles. And there's a specific guy that kind of had that school of thought that you learn about. That I don't remember his name anymore. And, uh, so it'd be kind of like, you know, pop culture is kind of like lowbrow, so you don't learn as much about it. Um, I think you do in designing craft has more modern stuff, but craft didn't have, um, modern enough. It was kind of like the industrial revolution and then kind of like the effects of the industrial revolution. Yeah. Modernity. Yeah. Kind of modernity was as late as... Uh, a bachelor gets you uh, in fine art. So I don't know what it's called. It would just be modern impressionistic to me. Anyways, thank you so much for watching the box opening. I don't know. I guess it's more of a faux box opening. Someone else box opened it before me. Although I don't know what's in here. <laughs> Do I? Um, anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching. Um, please like and subscribe. The bell's right up here. I'm going to post right over here the subscribe button at the end of the video, which should be popping up soon, which is why there's always a little more talking at the end so that it doesn't go over top of whatever I'm actually showing. Um, I'll try and I'll be doing a tactics uh, ogre uh, tarot deck. Because uh, this is a video game S counts coming to have more boxing and cards now. But, you know. Anyways, guys. Thanks so much. Please like and subscribe. Bye.